Hi guys. I showed you I bought a set of these geared motors. I think they're called N20s. And when I tried this one, it died. Um, initially it worked, but then it died. And I think what the problem was, uh, the screws holding the actual gearbox in place were loose. And I think it jammed and quite simply overheated. The other ones in the set all worked, and this one worked initially, as I say, but it jammed, and I did demonstrate taking it apart. Well, it's only a matter of undoing two screws. <laughs> and having taken the gearbox off, I could actually start the motor if I gave it a little bit of a twist which tells me that one of the coils on the commutator is probably either burnt out or um, damaged in one way or another so I thought we'd see if we can have a look inside I'm gonna have to use a microscope to look If we can actually look at the commutator, uh, sorry, at the um, I said commutator, didn't I? Ah, I have to get the gear off. Oh, that's annoying. All right, I'll see if I can pop the gear off. Ideally, you'd heat it. So it's a metal gear. I'll see if I can just pull it off. Right, I managed to get it off by gently putting my cutters behind it and levering them off. I'm going to have to go onto the microscope, this fella, and see what we can see. Right, we'll probably cut over to the other camera so we can look. Well, I can see a broken wire. Amazing. Might even be able to get in there with a soldering iron and fix that. Oh, hang on. Oh, there's another one. Right. Well, we're talking microscope visibility. I'm not going to be able to see that clearly with my eyes. That's going to be a real struggle to fix. I'm going to use my USB soldering iron because that's the one with the finest tip. I've got the microscope set up looking at what we need to solder. And I've got it up on the screen in front of me so I can actually see it. I've never tried to solder anything this fine before. I've soldered it. I've put it back together. And... I put power on it the right way around. You can probably see it jumping. It's working. That was well outside my comfort zone trying to do that. I'll pop the tags back down and see if we can get the gear back on the shaft. That should be fun. There we are. All back together. I think you can see that. I really didn't expect to be able to do that, but we did. I don't know how good the film was that I took with the microscope. We'll find out when I edit it. The only reason I can imagine it failed, it did work initially as soon as I put power on it, and then it stopped. 
but when we looked at it, the screws on the gearbox casing were loose. So I think possibly it gone out of alignment, jammed, that overheated it, and those solder tags that we saw um, melted and came loose. I can't think of any other reason for them to be broken like that. But that's what I think. I think it overheated, and I think it overheated because it had jammed. Maybe, possibly. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Leave us a comment so I know how I'm doing. And somewhere up here there'll be some links to related playlists. Thanks again.